Okay, well I'm here at the restaurant Blue Ginger. I'm here with a man who really needs not a lot of introduction. Ming Tsai, welcome to the show, Ming. Thanks, Dave. Great it's to be here. Such a pleasure, such a pleasure to be cooking with you today. Author of books, graduate of Yale, shows, you got TV shows as well. Couple shows, yep. You got uh, Cooking with Ming. You yep. got... Uh, Cooking with Ming? No, Simply Ming. Simply Ming. But I do cook with Ming. <laughs> That's all right, it's your first day. Very but thank you. Very accomplished. Again, I've seen your shows. It's such a pleasure to be cooking here with you today. Thank you. What are we going to do? You get tuna. I love cooking with tuna. We're actually, well, sort of going to cook. We're going to do a tuna poke. Okay. And if, what I want you to do, because I hear you're a hell of a chef. Yep, I get it. I get. I want uh, you to mince some chives and cut up some serrano chili. Seeds in, because that's where all the... Um, that's where all the heat is. Okay. And I'm going to take this beautiful piece of tuna and just make, make some dice because we're going to make a tartare. And <laughs> hey, let me tell you about this. This is a sushi <laughs> rice cake. It's a traditional sushi rice, which is made with a su, which is vinegar and mirror and a little sugar. We then make this cake. We add in some nori and some togarashi, which is a Japanese of spice. Okay. And this we're just going to deep fry. It takes about three minutes. So that's the only real cooking. This okay. is a tuna. Tuna we're going to do raw. All right, some chilies. Some strana chilies. Well, um, Same well, thing. Just, just one. Them, right? Just do one. Yep. Fine again? Yep. Really fine. Super fine. This knife is very cool, actually. It's a sharp knife, huh? Yeah. Actually. So I'm going to add to this a little bit of passion fruit vinaigrette, all right? So okay. passion fruit, if you ever had, it's also called lily koi in Hawaii. Pokey, by the way, is a traditional Hawaiian preparation that literally means cubed fish salted. That's all it means. So a little sea salt, sea salt from Mauritius, a little pepper. Okay. All right, we're gonna add, give me like seven of those slices. We don't wanna kill, our, kill ourselves, yeah, that's no. plenty. We're gonna take um, some, uh, this is watercress. Okay. Or uh, pepper crust. Tosaka, which is a Japanese seaweed. Add a little bit of yuzu, it's a citrus juice from Japan. Just yuzu. yuzu. Love it. Just a touch of canola oil. All right, so that, that once you just take this for it, mix that up a little bit. A little salt and pepper. And this is something you will actually serve in the restaurant here, right? Exactly. Tell me a little bit about uh, the style of cooking here, obviously, that you do at Blue Ginger. Look at this. Look how nice that looks, huh? It's GB and D. Ooh, it looks really Golden good. brown, delicious. That's important. Okay, see what I'm doing? I'm putting the hot cake on the bottom, all right? So obviously when we prep these, we cut them with the same mold. And uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm not a health chef, but because of my techniques, more braising and, and you know, not a lot of butter sauces and cream sauces, it ends up coming healthier than normal. Okay. How's our salad here? You know what I've actually used for some egg sandwiches before? Tin foil. You can make that stuff on a tin foil, right? Make a kind of cup with tin foil. You, you could. Drop it in. I've never thought of that. We, thank God our budgets aren't that to see it. Get rid of that. And last but not least, we take a little bit of this. This is watercress puree. And this is this is how we can now charge, you know, eighty-nine dollars for this. No, just right, kidding. It's like twelve bucks. But the walkers Make it look great. like you see in a picture. That's how it comes. Now, out. more importantly, though, I think we should try this, don't you? Absolutely. I, I think it it looks all pretty and stuff, but I think you got to go in. All right. Just go deep. How do you? Why do you get a spoon? Spoons get more than. Because you got all the forks dirty. All right. Give it a try. I know it's beautiful that way, but you know what? Food's meant to be eaten. Very good, very, very good. Well, listen, Ming, thank you so much. Hey, thanks Again, for having me. It was a me. pleasure having you on the show. It's I really great to appreciate be here. it. For this recipe, plenty more. Log on to onthehook.com as well. Come on in here to Blue Ginger. Please Ming do. I will absolutely set you up. Get one of his books, watch yep. his shows. Log on to Ming.com. Ming.com, pretty easy. Thanks pretty so much easy. again. Thanks, Dave. Peace.